It's real when your little kids are asking to go to bed at 620. Yeah. Happy birthday. Happy birthday party people. Well, I guess you get to enjoy dinner by yourself. has a little bit of fever not feeling his finest but we, nonetheless we are here to celebrate Britt's birthday what are you ready in your birthday swimsuit and oh going to catch some birthday waves are you gonna come watch me we're gonna paddle over okay. have a good time what do you want to do i want to show for my boy paddle around. i just want to paddle around yeah all right, let's go get your board while we wait for Banks to wake up and Mama. Hi. There's your wave. Oh. It's been so fun because there's been other families that have kids. Although this family is from Germany and their son Matt speaks German, Kru and him have been having the best of times. And then there was another family that had two kids that spoke Indonesian and English and crew had the best of times with them too. It's just cool how kids, despite language barriers, can still just have fun and don't even really care if you don't speak the same language. As long as you can play, it's all that matters, dude. How was it, birthday queen? Okay. No! storm and now there's the most insane rainbow so close look at this thing that's the bay we were at showing us the pot of gold and here it goes Shoo. so the hotel then isn't going to be able to do the bonfire they said they were going to do tonight so right now we're collecting coral to spell happy birthday for Brit, and we're going to try to surprise her All right, there it is. It's real when your little kids are asking to go to bed at 6.20. Yeah. Happy birthday. Happy birthday party, people. Uh, well, I guess you get to enjoy dinner by yourself. Are you gonna come eat with me? I'm gonna come eat with you. So I failed on my husband duties. I was supposed to get a video of them singing happy birthday to Britt last night and the cake they made. But I was busy singing. <clears throat> so I didn't make a... Uh, the video but one of the other guests here at the hotel did so i'm gonna try to get that and and we can add it to the video to see happy birthday but pretty much crew full-on woke up with like the full fever that i had and not feeling good on his birthday so he was asked so we asked him if he wants to move his birthday to tomorrow and he said yes so we're gonna celebrate his birthday tomorrow 
so that's uh that's the update from here so we're probably just gonna be taking care of sick kids all day today but we will share more on birthday tomorrow so we woke up today and crew's still not feeling good but we are gonna try and make him feel special so like all of our family's been calling on to facetime him so we're walking him over to this um place where there's wi-fi so that he can talk to everybody I'm so excited. This is like one of those moments where you're just like so pumped to be a mom. I made the scavenger hunt for him. Oh my gosh, you did. You wrote a novel. <laughs> There's eight different spots. Do you think that's too many? I think that's a lot, but it sounds fun, okay. I guess. Okay. <gasps> Mama's gotta go hide him and then we're gonna go on the scavenger hunt. Are you ready? Yeah! Okay, I wrote down all these clues and I'm gonna like hide them around the resort, like where we've been doing things. And hopefully it doesn't rain on them or people take them. <laughs> but here we go, first clue, tramp. Okay, it's all ready. Let's go get him. I literally think I'm more excited than him for these things. Crew, it's ready. You see the first paper? Okay. Hi, crew. Welcome to your birthday scavenger hunt. Today is a very special day because you are Four. Mom and Dad are so proud of you, and we love you so much. We want to show you how proud we are. You already know what it is. Okay, go go find it. Okay, you found the trampoline. Good job. Your next clue is hidden in the jackpot spot for finding hermit crabs. Remember where this is? You're the best hermit crab finder I know. Where's the jackpot spot for hermit crabs? You already see it. You found the next clue, hooray. The next clue is at the place where you asked for coconut. Do you remember where that is? The coconut shed. The coconut shed. And there's one present at the coconut shed. There's one present. All right, this one says, great job. You found your next clue. There's only one clue left to find the prize. Go to the place where you've been playing with those colored balls on the table. We've made so many friends. There's the paper. What was the clue? Oh, read the paper. Clue. You are so confident. We love watching you try and learn new things. Go to the new game you've been learning with the paddles and balls, and your prize will be there. What is it? Found your prize. We've been so excited to play this new game with you since we lost the matching game. Happy birthday, crew. We love you. Happy birthday, crew. I found the same for you in Australia. And that car. Fortunately, the weather's not as nice today, so we'll see what we make it to go do. But tomorrow is the day we leave when we start our full journey home. So we're glad he's feeling a little bit better today to kind of celebrate. And, um, I think when this video comes out, we'll be on our last leg going home. Happy birthday, dear crew. Happy birthday to you. Alawita Resort set up a bonfire for crew's birthday, and he's so excited. So it's gonna be for the whole resort. All of our friends, it's our last night here. And so he wants to say bye to everyone. It's gonna be so cute. Crew, when do you think they're gonna light this thing? When are they gonna light this thing? This has to be up. Oh, birthday fire! Well, we're gonna enjoy the rest of the birthday as a family. But we love you all. We begin our journeys tomorrow. We've got some exciting stuff coming up in our next few videos. Um, yeah, it's gonna be absolute mayhem when we get home. Stay tuned for our vlogs. <laughs> this is about to.
Bye. Bye.